Yo, what's going on, Sexy Seven Lunder Squad? How you guys doing? Thank you so much for the the subs yesterday. I uh, I called out, you know, anyone who wasn't subbed that liked the videos. I asked them to sub, please, and uh, well, it worked because we are over 85k by a bit, I think. Hold on, I'm going to my social blade right now because it's the only fucking way that I can figure things out real quick. All uh, right. Y'all wanted to Bravo. see this Nirvana skin, but what skin was it? Well, okay, so you see, I don't have actually the skin you want, I think. And I don't have a skin booster. Well, unfortunate, but whatever. We'll just beat him. Uh, Alright, let's go to Social Blade now. Let's see. Sam the Dude. What a failing YouTube channel looks like. Click on this button. Click Live Sub Count and see what's up. Oh, fuck, bro. 85,156. Y'all got me 170 subs yesterday. That's fucking wild, yo. Thank you guys so much. Oh, my God. I was not expecting that. I was expecting maybe... 85,030 or something like that. Hey, uh, y'all ever been so broke that you go out and buy a $3 baguette just to eat for two days? Or is that just me? Because, like, <laughs> that's that's about all I got. Don't look at my drugs. What the? It's just Claritin D. It's, it's for allergies. I live in Georgia and I have fucked up allergies. Bad joke, whatever. Let's, uh, am I scared of him? How, how man intensive am I? Oh, not very at all. So we're gonna go multi pots for sure, for sure, for sure. Uh, I'm not scared, so I don't need to get my two. I'm not scared to die uh, to him. At least not level three. <coughs> level five, I am. But uh, oh man, this is gonna be a a little bit of a um, not a difficult matchup. I actually think this matchup is pretty good for me. Um, but it's going to be difficult to stick to him. I'm going to have to get some weird shit going. I think I win this fight. Oh, he actually got his one, too. If he didn't have his one, I would have killed him right there. What a sick play, boys. What a sick play. He dashed in and we hit him with the... Uh, what'd you say, bitch? And kicked him in the teeth. Can I get this or will I get absolutely pub stomped? I mean, so far so good, right? He's doing his blue. I'm not scared. Oh, so much damage. Oh, ho, ho, ho. quick reflex, my boy. Quick reflex. I'll give it to you. That was hot. That was some spice. Alright, I'm gonna hit that B button real quick, though. You don't mind, right? Alright. Gonna snag that. Let's go get our red. Man, that first blood was sick though. He blinked in, or he didn't blink in, right? He he wound in. He tele he shat water fuck, what what is the thing called? He water cloned in. Um I heard him doing these. But I guess he backed after. I want Crusher next, and then after Crusher, I want Crusher just because when I hit him with an, an ability, he's then going to like go stealth and run away, obviously, and that Crusher tick will uh, bring out his deepest, darkest desires. I've been watching a lot of Lucifer lately, my bad. <laughs> Alright, so he's got, uh, he actually did a pretty bad play in my opinion, and stopped 
stop the Bancrofts to go into the boots there because a lot of people do that when they back and they have like 900 to 1,000 gold, but they don't have that 1,100 like over the mark for Bancrofts yet. They just go straight into boots. And I personally think if you want to go Bancrofts, um, don't start with the starter and just go straight into Bancrofts. Um, but he actually started with the starter, started with Bancrofts, and then is waiting to build it, which isn't bad really it's just not what i would consider very good i can't really kill him here he's got bracer so if i all in him um okay let me tell you how that fight would go i alt him he doesn't have his one right i alt him he immediately bracers and then he uh alts me right i'm tossed up in the air like a fucking can of potatoes like a like a penguin being attacked by a seal, right? He doesn't give a shit about me anymore. I'm dead as far as he's concerned. So what he does, he ults me. All of a sudden, I'm a penguin. Um, and then he just walks around his tower. I do have my root up, yeah, but that's not going to stop me for, or help me from uh, getting close enough to him fast enough. I'm just going to ult this. The reason I'm ulting that is because... Um, She's outside, babe. The reason I'm alting that is because I didn't want him to get that full duration of his two off because I probably would have died if he had. Alright. Hmm. He could probably fuck me up here a little bit. Alright, never mind. You gonna ult me? Yeah, okay. He ulted way too late. Way, way too late. This is probably a surrender rope coming out. Uh, I don't think he really understands how to play out Kwong. He might just be playing him because either he's streaming and got a donation request. I don't know who this is, but I mean, a lot of people stream Smite now. Uh, he's streaming, got a donation request, or he just wanted to fuck around a game. Um, but I doubt that he's gonna play this out. Probably one more kill he surrenders, I assume. Because it it's not only like... I'm not just killing him, you know? Like, I'm killing him. And it's not necessarily all fights that are really amazing for me. And at the same time, it seems like he really can't do anything to me. And when you have that kind of combination where you're behind um, in the game. And you have that feeling of just... There's nothing I can do. It really does just come down to... How long can I stick it out before I surrender? Or I could be taking away all the credit that he uh, will get. And he'll actually play this game out and try to learn if he is like an Aokong main or wants to be an Aokong main or something. And try to learn from this matchup. But it just depends on what kind of player he is. I mean, if he just wants that TP, he's going to surrender and try to get in the next game. The way it looks like right now is definitely a surrender because, I mean, shit, what's he gonna do, right? That's it, I kill him here. Yeah, probably a surrender. Actually sticking it out, you know what, dude? Big ups. Didn't think you would stick it out. Hey, that, uh... That, uh... Green tea is really fucking good. You should try one. Oh, can you... Right here. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so let's see. Once he gets Bancrofts online, he could actually beat my ass. That's why I'm getting beat sick online right now. Do I stop myself from getting red buff to try to steal his blue to further my lead? Or is that just like a dick move? It's not carbonated at all, by the way. Just in case you might think it is. It's really good, isn't it? A zero calorie, baby! <laughs> All 
All right. We got the red. We got the blue. I'm not scared of him. We got a beat stick. Now we'll actually start building into some defense. Um, luckily for me, I'm a physical god, which means that I can get thorns because if he builds physical defense, it doesn't protect from thorns because, as everyone knows, thorns is magical damage, which is why you don't want to buy thorns if you're a mage. A lot of people get that uh, get that mixed up. Okay. Where the hell did he go? <laughs> I could just go and do Bull Demon. The thing is, about Bull Demon is if I do it, uh, I have no physical protection or protection in general. So I'm just gonna get my ass slammed. So I don't know if I really wanna do that yet. I'll probably wait it out, maybe another, actually, I don't know, it might be best to do it as early as possible before he starts swinging hard, you know? Because when he starts swinging hard, that's when my opportunities lessen. You know what, fuck it. Let's take our opportunity and uh, see what we can do with it. Roll with it for a little bit, see if we can make anything happen. I'm gonna alt it to secure. It had literally one HP, that would have been just fucking terrible. Was a good try. Was a very good try, actually. If I didn't brace her, I probably would have been executed there. And a lot of people might have thought that was an early bracer, but I had already used my two, and so there's no way in hell that I was gonna live through his execute, unless I bracered right before it. I have a big ass shield right now. Oh. I'm a little bit surprised he didn't die, if I'm being completely honest. Let's back now. Grab our Genjis. He can't get to me in time. He already used his blink, so. Actually, uh, instead of Genjis, I don't need cooldown. I'm gonna go Shogun's. I'm gonna get the extra attack speed. Um. It does give me, like, no HP, which Genji's does give, which is pretty, like, good for the item. Um, and a little bit less protection. Oh, it gives 10% cooldown anyways. Whatever. Bad pickup. Bad idea. I don't need the attacks. Uh, actually, no. I actually stick with it. I think I do need 20% more attack speed, more than I need 10 protection and 150 health. Because at this point in the game, I already have his Phoenix down, and it seems like I'm going to be able to hold it down, so whatever helps me kill the Titan faster, you know? Doesn't do that much damage, I'm not that scared of it in those terms, you know, so... I'm thinking maybe we get an Aussie or something. Full commit to this attack speed Robin play. All right, we got that uh, Titan down to 2,000 HP. Bonkers. He's got cooldown now. He's got max cooldown, actually, with that blue buff. The whole, my whole plan is to just make it so he doesn't clear wave. That's literally all I'm trying to do. Oh shit, I did it. Oh, damn, dude. My bracer to get out of the execute range. I get tossed up, immune the last Titan smack to live and go back in for the kill. Sick play. If you guys enjoyed that video, make sure to like, comment, and of course subscribe 170 subs yesterday fucking insane thank you guys and uh i'll see you next time peace